Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich. Welcome back to Let's Play Grand Theft Auto San Andreas and in our last mission, or our last thing, we uh, completed our vigilante missions. So, got all the way up to level 12. So that leaves only, I think, firefighter left, right? Oh no, there's like pimping and things like that. Oh, we can't take that car. Let's take this car. I mean, I know there's a cop right there, but he's busy, so he won't... We certainly won't get a wanted level. Oh, we did. Oh, well, whatever. Um, okay. But it's time to go see Woozy, because he has a business here in town. And, uh, yeah. Well, actually, that's kind of it. He has a business. Now, you actually kind of want to avoid... Oh, maybe not. It's because you want to avoid the interstate, but you, I guess not. Like... Because this is, this is the airport, and... Seriously with that? You just ran that guy over, lady. Oh. Man, everybody! Come on with this. I really just want to get to the strip. Alright. Because that's where we'll find Woozy. Oh, there's street races. Fine, whatever. We'll just go this way. All right. At some point, we're going to have to deal with the arenas as well. Because, yeah. Because it's a thing we can do. Hmm. Oh. We're fools. Yeah, see, that's what we needed to do. Ta-da. What just happened? Oh. Okay, we triggered a thing. Go inside the Four Dragon Casino to see Woozy. I see. Well, it's nice that there's a police bribe right there. Bam. Let's hit things. That's the name of this game. Oh, you asshole, my shit. All right. And there is an ammunition almost directly across the street. I think it's actually down a little ways, though. So the Four Dragons Casino um, has a save point out in front of it, which is nice. And we actually have to go inside to trigger missions. So uh, we can, but you can play games. Um... But, again, our, our, our money amount is kind of so crazy. Oh, we have, like, no weapons. Right? Yeah, we have no weapons. Yeah, see, we can, like... To play blackjack, and the max wager is $100, which is nothing. Yeah, play roulette and the max. Okay. Well, let's just... Let's just put our... We'll just put our We'll put our max amount at twenty. Because it's my favorite number. Red twenty five. Whatever. thank you for playing, sir. Uh there is I think a wheel of fortune in this in at least one of the casinos around here. Oh yeah, there's this the, the Buddha with the huge wheel, that's great. All right, Woozy is, I guess, behind here. But we should probably... Is this it? Oh, no, it's over here. All right. No more All right. There's no way that this is going to happen, but... Oh, I like the, the camera work there. Well, we missed the star. A dollar, of course. It's like the most likely space. Okay. Now, you'll get really sick of this song because it's the only thing that plays in this casino, I think. All right. Not a fan of this, but uh, it's it's a fun mission. Idiot. Do you realize how much those machines cost? We're supposed to be opening it... What the fuck was that? 
Hello? Hello? <clears throat> what the fuck is wrong with you people? Boss, CJ's here. Carl, glad you can make it. So, this what you've been doing? Yeah, it's been a complete nightmare. You want a stomach ulcer? Try opening a triad casino in a mafia-run town. The mob trying to squeeze you? Yeah, the corporations are moving in and everybody's feeling the squeeze. I've had slot machines busted up, workmen being scared off. So who behind this? Huh? Well, there are these three mob families operating here, and each of them has a stake in Caligula's casino. And some whacked-out lawyers running for them. It could be any one of them, or all of them. Can't you just give them a little something? No. In addition to the usual authorities that need bribing, each one would want a slice. And I'm not about to hand over all our profits to some wise guy Italian. Our profit? That's right, you heard me. I want to offer you a share in our casino. In exchange for some help setting it up. How's that sound, partner? Sound like we got a deal then. <laughs> Boss, the boys found some thugs trying to smash one of the deliveries. We caught one of them. Get rid of him. Hey, wait, hold up, hold up, come here. Whoever's behind this... We need to let them know that they're dealing with full-fledged psychos. <laughs> Time to the front of the car, then you sweat it out a little, and I'll be out there in a little while. I love that. I love that. I love this whole setup. See if we can make this guy squeal. That's my car. Yeah, and like, and Woozy's just so great. He's just like, what I need is Carl. Like... They are, they're really good friends. It's awesome to see. Caesar's pretty cool too, but I don't know. Something about Woozy. Just like him. He's just no nonsense. Now I hate this mission, but it's it's okay. Hey, who the fuck? Who are you? What time, huh? You know what? I think we're gonna take a little drive. What are you fucking stupid? I'm not joking here. Untie me, motherfucker. Alright, now the problem with this. I think I'm gonna leave you right where you are. Is you gotta drive to scare this guy? But you can't hit anything. Who the fuck I am? No, but I think I'm gonna find out. Okay, yeah, insane stunts will get him shaken up. But if you do something like take a jump or something. All right, driving in the wrong side on the wrong side of the, the street really helps, but I mean you really got to go fast. Oh jeez, yeah, see, and like we killed him, so that doesn't work. So now we got to try again. And if you go out in the interstate, you instantly get a wanted level. So that's it's really you got to drive up and down the strip doing like handbrake turns and things like that. It's not a horrible mission. It's it's a lot of repetition though. So, uh let's give it another shot. Shall we? Yeah, vertical see which we want to see you try it again and again and again. All right. We're doing bike school after this though. Just cuz I want to get these things out of the way. Ugh, or maybe, no, because we can't do horseshoe collection. We're going to have to unlock some other stuff. I, you know, I, I, there's a vehicle I want to get before we do that. All right. All right. Now we got to gotta wait for cutscenes. It would be nice to get this done, but... Hey, hey, who the fuck? Who are you? One time, huh? You sign your own death warrant! <laughs> oh. Alright. You think this is scaring me, huh? I do, actually. It would be scaring me. Look out! 
Wow, how did that not kill him? That was that was awesome. Now eventually what's gonna happen though is the strip does the strip does kind of do this crazy thing where it stops being this like side by side two lane road. So Yeah, I mean, he'll just say stuff like this. It is really hard to kind of get his scarrow meter up there. I don't know if it goes up on the wrong side of the road better. But, like, let's see if just going fast will do it. Because that would actually be nice if we could just get it by going fast. Jeez, he should so be scared. Like, how could he not be terrified at this point? Like, I'm a little terrified. I'm driving. Oh, jeez. How did that not kill him? And they really want us to drive on the wrong side of the road. All right, fine. We'll drive on the wrong side of the road as fast as we can. Yes, you're very lucky. You're a lucky, lucky guy. You're gonna kill both of us. Oh my god, I'm still alive. Hey, you think you're smart, but you're not. You're not. Alright, yeah, see, we were right at the point where, like, the road would have, uh... I mean, we're almost there. We've almost got him. All right, come on. Yeah, insane stunts, but like I'm not really equipped to do a lot of that right now. Like I don't know where there's a place where I could take a good jump or something. Keep him off the pavement. Jeez! Hey, fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I was just driving on the wrong side of the road. What you doing? Come on, fill out that scarrow meter. Jeez, driving on the wrong side of the road is hard. Come on, man. Just spill your guts then. Oh, fuck you too. Hey, fuck you. Fuck you. Come on. All right, we've almost got him. Just say the thing you want to say, man. Like, just spill it. Just spill it. Jeez, we almost killed him there. Wow. All right, come on. Come on. This car's almost done. This should not be taking this long. It really shouldn't. Then spill it, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. Say it. Seriously looks full. Oh 
my god, I just shit myself. Yeah, we know. Come on. I cannot believe this. What did the game glitch out or something? Yeah. Okay. Now we've just got to drive him back. Without hitting him on the front of anything. 15 minutes, not horrible. I mean, we didn't really start the mission the time that we actually got through it. Until like 9 minutes, so... Not bad. Would certainly be a shame to hit something now. Or have an insane driver get ya. Alright! <coughs> now he's a dead man. Alright! We passed our first woozy mission. How great is that? Well, our first woozy Las Ventura mission. I don't think we're going to do bike school next. I think uh, I'm going to go over to the ammunition and load up and maybe get something to eat. Uh, oh, what we should do um, before we do the next mission, though, is go to the gym here because we haven't done that yet. So we'll be saving our game, and uh, you guys, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Bye, everybody.